system. Let's go to the dashboard, fix some quick things up while that's doing its thing. Um, cancel. Is it not? Ah, there we go. So what about if I do that now? What about if I restart now? Refresh. Refresh the thing. And I'll just put a, I'll need to mute that. Um, start. Go. Oh, wait, no. Let's get rid of that. And hello, everybody. I'm just fixing a few things quickly and then I'll be up and running. Start. Go. Exit. Hopefully everything is all right so far. And he's gone to here. Hello, everything NRL HD, NRL Trading Card Lounge, and Ben Maloney. How are we all going today, guys? How are we all going? I get rid of that. Let's see if I can do this. Let's see if I can just try to edit this. Seems like I can do, which seems a lot easier. Um. Save that, and we are good. Hey, CT Dingo. Hello, Jack Dempsey. I'm doing very well, thank you. Training Guard Lounge, and good, thank you very much. Everything NRL HD. Who's excited? Who's excited for this? Because I am definitely excited for this. I'm very, very excited. What was that? I'm just trying to do one quick thing before we start here, but it's not working how I remember it. So, just a little bit frustrating. There we go. There we go. Now it's up and running. Go back to here. I've seen diggers and they look pretty good. Uh, we're going to chat before the box. I'll get right into it. Pretty much going to get right into it. Just a little little five minutes and then uh, we'll get into it. Just make sure everyone is able to get here. Um, I have only seen one break, which is um, a, a break I was involved in. I paid for a spot in a group break. Um, didn't get anything out of it. I think I only got one platinum out of it, um, which is why I don't normally do do that stuff, just because I personally don't see a point in it. Um, but that's all I've seen and I'm looking forward to get into this. Now, this is a priority. Um, as you can see, I've already opened packaging, but this is the thing. So you can see it definitely is a priority edition of the box. Got a few packs myself yesterday. Pulled a Manly Team photo, Maroon Slater card. One per box looks sick. Well, that is good to hear. But yeah, very, very excited to get into this box right here. Hopefully we can pull something cool. This is a priority, so let me know what your predictions are for this. Um, and if you know what is meant to be included in a priority box, let me know. Um, from what I've sourced, it looks like there will be... Um, the normal stuff and then like two numbered hits, I believe it is. So that looks be pretty damn good 
Um, so yeah, pretty excited. Jump back over here. And we'll pretty much get straight into it. Um, read out predictions. Yeah, okay, I'll do that. Give me one second. Let me just pull that away a little bit. Let's go into um back. So there's the last video uploaded. There was comments. So the predictions I have. There was a new one that came in as well from NRL Trading Card Lounge. So uh, CT Dingo says prediction is a white. Uh, League Sensation Cam Munster, which would be pretty cool. Deliam Mike Acevo, Deliam John Bateman, Young Gun Priority Ronaldo Militalo in a Ruby uh, Dogs checklist. So um, that's from CT Dingo. Entertain House has a Bulldogs Ruby, a Black Wade Graham, a, a Black Wade Graham signature. Deliam N um, Priority Young Gun Silver, Young Gun Sam Verrells. Um, and uh, NRL Training Card Lounge says Deli M Priority Payne Haas and James Tedesco Young Gun Priority Jaden Sewer Master Series uh, Kangaroos Billy Sailor 15 of 18 League Sensations Ryan Madison Moji Sapphire Jesse Ramian and he hopes I get some big hits thank you Training Card Lounge hopefully I will uh so, two Deli M numbered cards and a numbered white young gun. Alrighty. So, let me just get this. I am going to record this as well and then upload it. So, there's going to be a loud beep there. And I'm also going to record. I've got my GoPro here so I can record on that and do a video of it afterwards for you guys. So, if you guys weren't, there, weren't in the live stream, you'll be checking out this stream right now of this um, priority. Let's get that out again. Priority 2020 Elite Trading Card Box. So very cool, very exciting for this. Hopefully we can get some cool cards. And just before we get into it, last prediction I'll read out is Ben Maloney Raiders team photo, Ruby Ryan and Madison, and a Slater's Kangaroo signature. So we're going to open the entire box here, guys. Like I said, if you are excited, hit that like button and show your excitement. Also, these packets look sick. They've got a nice little like texture to them, and um, they look pretty damn good. Now, I did order another box of these, and um, I have already actually pre-recorded that entire box. Let me know when you want me to upload them. If you want me to upload them, like on a specific day, I'm thinking Mondays, and I'm going to be spacing them out. I'm thinking. I'm thinking once a month or maybe twice a month. Not 100% sure. Um, just depend on how often I can actually get these because they are expensive. Um, but um, I have opened up a whole box already. So let's see what these g are like. So I'll open these for the GoPro and then I'll show you guys as well. And... Let's go and try to figure out. Let's just throw the rubbish down there. So, I'm not really sure how to do this. Do I show this for you guys, or do I? Do you guys want me to have like hold them up here so you guys can see, or try to figure that one out? Once a fortnight. I'm thinking once a fortnight. I am thinking once a fortnight. And hello, Greasy Gaming, coming in. Um. Yeah, let's open it for you guys on this camera and then I'll show the GoPro afterwards. Um, so, do it this way. We have a Dean Fare. I'll only go through it for the first couple of packs. Um, I won't show all of them. A Dean Fare, a Broncos checklist, a George DeFua, a Clint Gutherson, and a. Um, our first decade chart bust start right there is the meters for Aiden Tolman number three. Is that number three? Yeah, number three for the Can Canterbury Bankstown Bulldogs. 
two, uh, 28,851 right there for the Aiden Tolman. So Tolman is a tough and consistent competitor. The Bulldogs prop has surpassed 3,000 running meters in six, uh, six times in his career, including the 2019 season. His best haul uh, came in the 2016 when he commenced 3,350 running meters in 25 appearances. Number 15 of 18 right there for Aiden Holman. Very, very cool. Uh, then we got a Tyron Roberts, a David Nofaluma, and a Jesse Ramian. Also, I'm just going to scrap this GoPro kind of setup. Um, I thought it was going to be a good idea, but let's just do it this way here. So, not a bad start, I don't think. You know, meters straight away for um, Canary, Bulldog, uh, Canary Bankstown Bulldogs Aiden Tolman right there. That is very cool. Second packet in. So let me know. Yeah, let me know, you guys know what your best um, card is you've pulled so far. If you've pulled any, um, if you've opened any packets at all. So, ooh, there's a little. See if I can. I don't think you. Oh, there's a little something. You can kind of see that little something there. So, if I pull that up. I should actually be able to. Do it like this so you guys can see it and i can see it as well so you've got a, a roosters checklist a valentine homes felice Cafusi, and a ruby trent merrin oi second pack in let's go let's go trent merrin what number do we reckon it is what number where Oh, notification game. Um, let's let's just skip to the um, next card first. So we've got a Sean Johnson, um, Putnam there. We've got a Cody Nicarima, a Edric Lee, and a Rabdo's Checklist right there. But what numbers, what number do we think that this is out of 40? It's 40, isn't it, for these? Um... I remember. Yeah. So we've got 19, 32, 14. I'm going to guess 21 out of 40 for this one. It is. Um, Greasy was close. It is number 34 of 40. He said 32. That's very close. Trent Merrin for the St. George Illawarra Dragons. The so Merrin was a member of the club's 2010 Premiership side and back and is back. I'm sorry, this way. Back his beloved Red V after the stint at the Panthers in the and the Super English Super League. Merrin is a skillful and hardworking forward who will add experience to the Dragons pack. The so number 34 or 40 right there. The second packet in is the Trent Merrin. Very, very cool. Does Greasy win the card? Nope. <laughs> these are mine. Um, I, might, I might be doing a box break of these for you guys in the future. If you guys want, uh, want that, let me know. I'll probably price it at about $20 a spot um, just to cover all the costings and pricings and stuff. Um, and then the little bit of money I'll make will go back into the channel. Um, so if you guys want a group break, let me know and I'll see what I can do for you guys um, Another kind of shiny card looks like it will be another um, decade chart buster from the side but um, Let's see what we get. So we got Ryan Pappenhausen Try to hold it in a way that isn't let's See if I can actually get closer to the Let's do the screen here And then have it in a in focus Got Ryan Peppenhausen. Might just be a platinum. We got a Luke Keary, a Darius Boyd, 
And a, yep, a platinum Adam Dewey right there for the Tigers. So you guys see that if you guys haven't seen it before. Nice little platinum edge with the background also a little bit shiny compared to the normal cards. Player not shiny. I do like the fact that the player is just a normal um, image and not platinum, so it stands out a little bit more. And then we got a Warriors checklist, Guy Arrow, and a Trent Merrin. Look <laughs> at that, normal Trent Merrin, and a Will Hopper Wate right there. The first, is that what we classify as a dud pack for this uh, set? Anyone that knows, do let me know in the comments, but um, I believe that's a dud pack. So we've got a, what is the, let me, let me try something. Let me try just putting the lights on and see if that fixes it. Let's see if it's adding a little bit more light fixes it or if it makes it a little bit worse. Might make that a little bit worse. I'm gonna go turn them back off. There we go. Alright, so yes, dud pack. Alright, good to know. So we got a Jake Friend. We have a Joseph Tarpany. Really hard at the moment to try to get a good lighting for these, isn't it? I uh, kind of like rep style with that parallel. Yeah, right. David for Fita. Oi! Oi! Oi, get in there! Oi! Dingo, you didn't miss anything. You came back just in time. Oi, that is sick. Chanel Harris to Vita Redemption Spotlight card. Oi. So that is numbered 46 of 80 for the Chanel Harris to Vita Spotlight. Oh, that is gas. Oi. Oh, I was after the Josh Hodgson, but still, that is game use memorabilia, you know? Oi, oh, I'll definitely be saying that in very, very soon. Let's go. <laughs> I did. I had no reaction because I, 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 I wasn't expecting it. Apparently, it was a sick version, but still awesome. I mean, I'm. T I'll take it. I'll. I'll hundred percent take that. Let's go. Happy Coruscant for the um, Panthers as a platinum. Alex Johnson, Tyrone Peachy. And Chad Townsend. Oi, that is sick. I, I can't redeem to September. September. Can't redeem until September. Is that what you mean? They used the Warriors 9 jersey for the uh, jersey patch, so it should be nice and colourful. Shit, yeah. I'm only doing the one box there, Jacob. Where's all the eels cards? <laughs> um, we still got heaps to go, man. We've only just started, so um. But also, like, re um, reaction-wise, I don't normally react over the top. I just like, I normally get speechless, like I just did. So um. Boy, that is sick. Is there a way you can figure out what card or what part of the jersey they'll use? Because uh, I know last year I think there was a way that you could find out what part of the jersey they'll use. Um, that is, oh, I'm so happy with that. All right, so, uh, Regan Campbell Gillard, Corey Horsburgh, Angus Crichton, Melbourne Storm Checklist, and I think this is a Masters collection, the card behind it. 
I see a little bit of the top there. I believe that's a Melbourne Storm Masters collection. No, it is a uh, Rikane McGregor for the Women in League um, round right there. Well, Women in League team for the Broncos. Very cool. First Women in League card so far. West Tigers checklist. A Billy Megalius and a Leeson R. Mao. It's actually cool because that's the card that they um their spotlight redemption card. That's the one they feature on the box. Um, I'm, that's pretty cool. Last year I pulled the Roosters. Uh, well, for the normal train cards I pulled the Roosters. Um, Premiership predictor this year I pulled the bloody redemption card. Let's go. Um, kind of new to collecting. What do you get for redemption cards? So for this redemption card specifically, um, Jacob, you get piece of the game worn memorabilia so you get a piece of the jersey as you can see right there uh, someone did say that it was be used the jersey they'll use was the nines jersey that'll be really cool uh you send this off and you get sent back a um card not sure if it's a booklet card or just a card and you get a piece of the um actual jersey down the bottom here it says image used is not from above match the jersey patch on this is authentic and guaranteed by the tla merchandise and nrl um slj number two of two but uh spotlight spotlight jersey number two of two that is very cool i'm very happy about that uh, hopefully i'll be able to pull the josh hodgson one and have both obviously not in this one um in a future box but priority box Paying off, you know, paying off. The Brody Croft, which I'm actually a big fan of Brody Croft. Um, Api Curacao, so we pulled the Platinum and the Normal now. Got a Michael Morgan. And a Chelsea Leonard Doozy. So back-to-back -back women in uh, league Broncos cards right there. Chelsea Leonard Doozy right there. Give you a little bit of a better close-up of that. Very cool card. Have a... Daniel Saifiti, a Ben Hunt, Adam Dewey, and Nick Meany right there to finish off that pack. I'll have a mail day this week from my group breaks I was in. That's cool. I I'm, I'm look forward to what cards you got in your breaks, um, Brody. We have a... Stephen Crichton. We have a Patrick Carrigan. Ruben Garrick. Alright, what does that mean? For yous out there that know about what that is, can you please let me know what that is? Got stars and two gold things on it. Who knows what that is? Who knows what that means? I don't want to open it yet. I want to see what people predict it is. I want to see if I, want, I should be gassed about it or not. Because last time it was kind of like a... That's the Priority Young Gun. Alright, so what, what do we predict the Priority Young Gun is going to be? Um, I'm going to say it's... Um, priority young gun is it the white or the black version um if it's white i'm gonna say it's someone like um renal militalo i'm gonna say mo fodawaker from the titans read marnie everyone's saying read or a couple of people there saying read marnie um I, i'm assuming it is the white one isn't it Young Gun, Jaden Sewer. You know, I was going to say Jaden Sewer. White Young Gun. Yeah, right. So I'm saying Mo Fodawaker. Let's see what it is. Obviously, a few Eels fans. So you're hoping for the Barney. It. Oi, let's go. Oi, no, that's actually sick. I kind of go for the um, Raiders. Is the Bailey Simmonson Young Gun specialty card? Oi, let's go. 
The priority is only white young guns. Oh, that is that is so cool. It's number 15 of 19 too. So uh, the priorities are numbered. As you can see there, 15 of 19 for Bailey Simonson. Obviously, uh, unfortunately injured at the moment. Um, but he is definitely a future star. Will definitely take over Nick Kotrick's spot once uh, Kotrick moves on from the Raiders next year. But that is awesome. I'm very happy with that card there. Nice card. Looks nice. Yeah, it does look nice. Um, I wasn't a big fan of the um, Club Heroes priorities for the normal trading cards. I'm happy that this does look quite nice um, and quite different um, to that is my GoPro turning off um, to um, the normal just white. Looks very cool. Got a Jake Friend Platinum Parallel. Our fourth Platinum. Got Nathan Pete's right there, a Knight's Checklist, and a James Roberts to finish that one off. So is there only one priority card in the Elites or is there two priority cards? Because um, is that like the only priority, uh, special priority card, special card in the priority boxes? Or is there another one? Hello, Pa. How are we, Pa? Very happy to see you in here. How have you been? Uh, we have a Cam Smith, a Eels checklist, Carl Felt, and a Decade Chart Buster, our second one for the box. It is the Cameron uh, Andrew McCulloch, number two for tackles. He made 9,713 for the Brisbane Broncos. was the year that he um, obviously did something special, most amount of tackles in the year, I guess. And his English NRL career, McCulloch has built reputation as a relentless worker in defence. The Broncos hooker surpassed 1,000 tackles in a season on four occasions, including career best 1,278 in the 2015 uh, season, where the Broncos made it to the grand final. Um, so I've gathered the fact that the image they used is the year that they actually like popped the whatever it is, so the meters run, the tackles, the points, or anything like that. So as you can see there. Andrew McCulloch, that jersey actually looks really nice. I actually quite enjoy that um, jersey on this card. It really stands out. It's really cool. That's number 11 of 18 for the chart busters. Alex Twall, um, Dylan Napa, Ken Mamalo, and a St. George uh, checklist. There is three, two Deli M's and the Young Gun. All right, so there's two more. Um, priorities to go. Good, like your hairdo. Well, you can reel off. Yeah, I have a. I, I struggle sometimes, Pa. Also, everyone in the comments, say hello to Pa. Um, he's in the chat, so say hello to him. Make him feel welcome. So we've got a boy corner. I actually really dislike this. Obviously, there wasn't a, a game he played in. They couldn't use a game photo, but I don't know. I, I, I reckon I would have preferred a photo from the 2019 um, grand final that you to use for this card rather than just this card. I'm actually quite disappointed about this. Um, so Boyd Cordner, a Scott Drinkwater, an Adam Noah Blake, and a Dragons um, team photo right there. See if we can get that in focus for you guys. Right there, Dragons team photo. See if we get that. No, we can't get that focus too well. But um, yeah, right. So uh, number thirteen of sixteen, right there, is the Dragons, followed up by Isaac Luke, who obviously isn't with the Dragons anymore, but was with the Dragons. Have a Imel Hunt and a Cody Walker along with a Aaron Woods. I also like the fact that um, in a box you actually complete the entire base set. You don't have to buy multiple boxes to complete the base set. A Chance Nickel Clockstad. And then. 
really difficult my setup at least Luke Keary Anthony Milford a Panthers checklist and what seems to be a chart buster no a um, platinum that is and Adam Fanua Blake right there David Clemmer Joe Mitchell and Thomas McKayley finished that one off and I started building them in the wrong spot it was just the last one. What's this last one? The last two packets on the top side of the box. I guess you can say the left side, but uh, top side. Let's see what we can get in these last two. See what side is the better one for you lot. Um, the leads a very small set when you think of it. It is a very small set, but I mean, it's still 160 base cards. So it's nice to know that they be guaranteed it in the first one. Most of the cards are coming of mojos not sure what that means uh, Gavin Cooper for the Cowboys Tom Travojevic Cameron Munster a Ryan Madison and a Broncos checklist platinum right there along with a Patrick Herbert a Damian Cook and a Wade Graham the last packet for the top side and we got a Blake Ferguson, Jerome Hughes, Danny Levi, Josh Papali and a Women in League Kathleen Wharton or is it is it is a WH and F or is WH a like a W? Because if it follows the same rule as uh, Dean Fare, it should be Farton. Um, I'm not sure if that's how you um, properly pronounce that name there. Um, if anyone knows, let me know down below. A okay. uh, Sharks checklist. A okay. Philip Sammy. And a Josh Jackson. All right, so that's the top side done. Now we move on to the bottom side. Bottom side, strong side. Potentially. We got Victor Radley. Cowboys checklist. Jared Croker. And a Masters series, the first one, and I think the only one for the box, yeah, is the Billy Slater Melbourne Storm 1516 Masters series. Let's see if we can get that a little bit better in focus. There we go, that's a little bit better. And that is number seven of 18 for that. So 2015, seven games, 2016, one game. Uh, so achievements nil due to injury later displayed the courage that provided his play on the field as he battled through a, a series of shoulder injuries and fought his way back into full fitness so quite a dull two years there for billy slater but that is cool to have cody walker platinum right there you have a Bulldogs checklist, a Corey Norman, and a Mitchell Pierce right there. Let's see what else we can get here. A Jason Tomalolo, Daly Cherry Evans, Brent Naden, and an assists number two. Another um, decade chart buster, Super Cronk number two, uh, 181 assists for the Melbourne Storm. So Cronk recorded a career best 37 try assists in 2008 as the Storm reached a third straight grand final. The next time Cronk surpassed 30 try assists in 2012, the Storm won the premiership. Uh, Cronk finished his career with three consecutive premierships. Um, Decade chart buster eight of eighteen right there. And the assists right there. I'll be going over all the cards I pull at the end of this. If you have missed any, I'll go over it at the end. Uh Roger Tulvas a check, 
right there. Blake Laurie, Connor Watson, and Joseph Lua. Um, I was going to do another two boxes for myself, but spending 375 Paris Team Six. Wow. Yeah, right. That is um, one way to spend money, I guess. When Isaiah Yo really like this pink uh, Panthers jersey they do have. A Dale Finucane. A Manly checklist. And a Karina Brown for the um, Sydney Roosters women in, in league right there. We have a Cam Murray. Titans checklist. Sean Johnson. And Chevelle, Chanel Harris Tavita, right there. Just bought seven packs. Gonna make a video on my channel, a video tonight for my card channel. That is good, um, Dingo. Hopefully, see some more up there soon. That's how much they're going, but should make it back through the breaks. Yeah, that's true. We got Corey Oates. Uh, Sia Takiaho, Reed Marnie, and we've got the first Deli M priority right here. Let's have predictions what you think the priority will be, what card it will be. We open the back here, we've got a Lachlan Lewis, a Corey Thompson, a Paul Vaughan, and a Platinum Adam Blair. Let's see what you guys think the Delhi M um, There we are Delhi M priority card will be Duva or Moses N I Nope How do I Why isn't this working properly? I need to go to YouTube to go to you. Um, um, that one report. Okay, and user in time out. Is that right? The wait. Hopefully, that has fixed that. No need for any of that stuff. Uh, what did I say? I think I said Sivo Bateman. Six packs premiere tonight. It's time. Yes, it is. What are your trader premiership predictors if the Knights? Um, a trader predictor is a Roosters. This is. I'm going to predict um, Dally M. Let's go with. Um, let's go Josh Jackson. This one, and it is Josh Jackson. Let's go. A little bit of the blue did, did uh, kind of give it away a little bit for me. Um, so Josh Jackson, Proven Summons medalist, right there. Priority card um, number sixty-five of sixty-seven. Um, the inspiring back rower. Um, Epitomizes the true spirit of rugby league. Jackson act of of sportsman. Jackson's act of sportsmanship when he um consoled West Tigers goal kicker Paul Morosky, who missed a goal that would have forced goal and point against the Bulldogs in round twenty one was one of the season highlights. Uh, so Delhi M sixteen of eighteen right there for the Josh Jackson. See the numbers right there. And the Josh Jackson Proven Summons medalist. That is the first of the um, first of the two Deli M's for this box. Um, good guess. Well, like I said, I did see the blue, so a little bit cheating, but oh well. Oh well. But a Jack Whiten, Mitch Moses, Boyd Cordner. Huh. 
Uh, I'm gonna go from the back here. A Heimel Hunt, a Isaac Luke, a Dalmatanis Lesniak, and a Tyrone Peachy Platinum. The reason I went, huh, is because um, that right there, I believe, is a um, Black Young Gun. I just had did have a quick look, and Bingo. Right. How it does? I can't really see it. But um, Eels Emerald or Sapphire. I have already pulled a Trent Marin em um Ruby, so I don't know if I can pull them. But it is the Ruben Garrick Black. It is black, isn't it? Ruben Garrick Seagulls. Ruben Garrick Black Young Gun. Right there for the manly wearing of seagulls. Bingo, how's that feel? Number 20 of 115. Young gun, black six of 16. But that looks pretty cool. Interesting, they use a blue background for this, not a maroon. But let's go. First black young gun for myself. Looks very cool, very nice. 20 of 115. Nice round 22. I like that. I do like that. The fact that it's a um, 20. Very, very cool. There we go. Dingo is. Dingo, you jealous? You jealous, bud? Let's go. Priority really doing it work here. Very, very worthy in the priority box. Raiders checklist. Josh McGuire. James Tedesco. Domain of Sarko. And a Raiders Redemption card for the team photo. Right there. Um, so where 2020 team cannot be sourced, a 2021 team photo will be used. Right there for the Raiders. Selling most of my traders. Really? Why are you selling most of your traders for? Like Club Heroes, etc. Um... Brody, let me get in contact with you about that. Let me, let me, let me, let me have some. Uh, so the Raiders redemption card. That is the second team for me. Um, Anthony Don had the Dragons earlier. Adam Reynolds and a Tim Glasby right there to finish that off. Towards the end of this box now. Elites may be expensive, but they're so worth it. Yeah, they really are. Uh, Scott Drinkwater, Adam Fenua Blake, Ryan Pappenhausen, Nathan Cleary, and a Georgia Hale for the Warriors in the Women in League um, set. Have a Cody Walker, a Aaron Woods, a um, New Zealand checklist right there. I don't collect my cars to sell. I collect them for my piece, the personal collection, unless I really don't like the player. Yeah, pretty much the same. Only doing eels, selling most of it. Um, heats, including colors, star tunes, etc. Um, yeah, I feel like for this set at least, like the elites, um, some cars I don't want, I will trade for cars I want. Um, so. I know I'm not going to complete this set to the standards that I would like to set. So um, stuff like um, rubies, I might trade rubies for like Titan rubies or Raiders rubies, depending on which one I want to complete. Um, so that is how that is. Joel Thompson, James Fisher Harris, Josh Addo Carr, Nick Kotrick, and a Paul Vaughan Platinum. Haven't had one of those just dud packs in a while. Adam Blair, Aiden Tolman, and Blake Braley. If you're looking for something, just message me. We'll work something out. Yeah, we'll do, Brody, man. We'll do. So we're coming down to the last few packs. We've got last four packets here. This is the fourth last packet. Have a time, Ruby, for you. Have kept it aside for you. Cheers. Cheers, mate. 
Uh, I sold Black League Sensations, Jordan McLean last year because the card didn't really feel right in my collection. I don't know why. I mean, yeah. You, you do you, man. You do you. Uh, John Asiata, your cards after all. You do what you want with them. Dylan Brown, Kyle Flanagan, and a Patelli Vettel Walsh for the w Women League Dragons team. A Tyson Rizal for the men's dragons, the back-to-back -back dragons players. Benji Marshall, Thomas Burgess, and Blake Green. Um, Tuggets look so sick, got to admit. I think last year's elites more than last year. Yeah, I like oh, this year's elites more than last year's. Yeah, I really like the um, packet design for this one. This giant arrow. Oh, yeah, very nice. Uh, let me before I pull it. Let me know what you guys think the second Deli M medalist is. Um, I'm just gonna throw it out there. I think it's going to be. Um, let's go Latrell Mitchell. Is everyone's best card in the collection? <laughs> so far, uh, Darius Boyd, Raven Campbell, Gillard, Corey Horsburgh, Angus Crichton. And another dud pack, Chance Nickel Clock's dad, platinum right there. Jai Arrow, Matt Marin, Will Hopawate. Second, last packet. And then I'll go over all the cards I've collected in this opening. Jesse Bromwich, Payne Haas, Jake Trebojevic, and it's a Cameron Smith. Deli M, Hooker of the Year, right there. Is the other priority um, Deli M? It is numbered 63 of 67. Very close to the end there for the Cam Smith uh, Deli M. Edric Lee, Platinum. Brian Kelly, Jerry Marshall King, and Kalen Ponga to end that one off. Let's see what this last pack has to offer. I'm assuming it's going to be a decade chart buster because I've only got three of those. We've got James Tarmow, Nathan Brown, Josh Hodgson, and it is a chart buster. Jared Croker points right there, number one. Um, for the point scored, Croker 1,948 Camera Raiders. So the Raiders center was a Deli M top point scorer in 2016, amassing 276 points in the regular season and finished the year with a club record 296 points. Um, Croker is the club's all-time leading point scorer and all-time leading try scorer. Um, chart buster 4 of 18 right there. Get a closer look of that. Try to get it out of the lie a little bit there. And then we got a Andrew Fafita, Josh Alaye, and James Graham along with the Tyron Peachy to finish that one off. So let's go over all the cards I've got today and um, show you what I've got. We will skip the Platinums. I don't feel like the Platinums are too, anything too special. Let's go with the teams first, so the Raid Redemption and the Dragons. Um, Team photo right there. Then let's go into the. Um, we'll, we'll go over the women league. We have the Patel Vettel Walsh, the Georgia Hale, the uh, Karina Brown, the Kathleen Barton or Wharton. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. I'm sorry. Chelsea Landuzzi and uh, Rakane McGregor for the women in leagues. Then let's go over the um, chart busters. So we've got the points, Jared Croker, number one. The points, number two, assists, uh, Grip Cronk. Number two, tackles, um, Andrew McCulloch. And number three, meters, Aiden Tolman, right there. Then we got the white, priority, young gun, uh, Bailey Simonson, right there for the Raiders. Very nice. Card right there. Let's try to get the pattern. There we go. Then we also pulled a black young gun Ruben Garrick for the Manly Ringer Seagulls. 
we pulled a Cam Smith Hooker of the Year, um, numbered 63 of 67 for the Delhi M, and Josh Jackson Proven Summons Medalist, right there, numbered 65 of 67. Are they both the same? Oh, 63 and 65. Yeah, right. So uh, that's my two um, Delhi M's. Then we pulled the Master Series Billy Slater, number 7 of 18, uh, years 2015 2016. Then we got a Trent Marin uh, Ruby Mojo, right there, numbered uh, 34 of 40 for the Mojo. And then the hit of the box was the Spotlight Aris Tavita for the Warriors jersey patch right there see if i can get it in a light where it's uh can't get it in a light that's good for the there we go harris vita right there numbered uh 46 of 80 46 of 80 Right there. Let's get the again. So that is my haul for today. Very happy indeed with that. Hope you guys did enjoy that. Um, I called Smith. Let's go. Good work. Um, traders. Yeah, we'll do that. Um, Brody. Penalty. Uh, plenty of hits in this priority box. Definitely feel like you got your money. Yeah, definitely got my money back for this one. Um, I'm actually interested to see how much a jersey spotlight go for um you always get your money back priority that's why you can only get one per person unless you make multiple accounts does the part where the fake jersey go you know is it the same height as the card um i'm not sure i'm not sure if it is just that or if it's like a booklet where they have like one side of the thing that would still be pretty cool though to have it um, come back like that let me go to um Let's go to the Diggers website here, see how much he's pricing these spotlights for. I'm sure he would have um, one of these already up on the store. About $100, $100 they go for. I thought they would go for more. Do they not go for more? Does he not have it up? Have him up. I thought he would have had him up. Oh, so a hundred bucks. So, oh, that's pretty still decent. Uh, that's the one with the patch, no booklet, st still sick. Well, yeah, still sick, still happy with it. Still, like, I, I personally don't care about how much the card costs because um, it's, you know, game use memorabilia. There's the only way you can kind of get this. So it's very cool that I have one of those in my possession. If you guys did enjoy this stream, make sure you guys do hit that like button. It is at nine likes. Let's try to get it to 10 likes before I end the stream. And um, hopefully you guys will um, watch this when I, I'll try to do this a, as a video as well, a highlights video. Keep an eye out for that. Subscribe if you are new, you did enjoy and you want to see more. Um, see you all in the next one.